this is a new day and I'm in a different part. I'm still in Fadil but on the other side of it. This is one of my favorite places also. Uh, today is quite gloomy and a little bit chilly so I'm wearing a jacket. I spent one, I spent almost the whole morning uh, over there in the bar. Uh, I'm pretty sure I showed you some clips. Um, just working away, writing a bit and doing some work things. And now I'm going for a walk because a bit later I'm meeting one of my friends. Before that I went to go and buy that dress that I was checking out yesterday. That uh, long checkered one. We will see <laughs> if they still have it. And right now I want to go to the market which is over there. Uh, which is one of historical Kiev markets. And I just, I love go going there and seeing fruits and vegetables. and. Uh, I would love to buy a basket, so we will see if they have something. Uh, anyways, sorry, crossing the road. Okay, almost there. Honestly, maybe because it's not a weekend. Uh, and I also only saw baskets in one place and they were like 20 euros, so no thank you. Uh, okay. So, now my plan is, after I worked very productively this morning, I was hoping to finish everything because I still need to buy tickets for Oslo and the problem is that I forgot my other credit card at home so I was not able to finish any of the bookings not for Airbnb, not for the uh, flight tickets, not for the plane but it's okay, I will do it tonight from home and here now we are going to... I think I will walk a little bit here because it's a very cute neighborhood, I really like it it's very historical. As I said, I can tell you its story some other time, but not now. Anyways, here's there are many many churches like this one. And many other cool things. So uh, going for a walk, then maybe going to another part of the city. Because I will need to meet my friend quite later. So maybe I'll still go and work somewhere else. This is kind of feeling like the creative juice is flowing and just feeling very inspired today. So we'll see. We'll see what the day will bring. Now it's around five something and I'm supposed to meet her around eight. So I still have some time. Anyways, look how pretty. I really, really love this neighborhood. If I were to ever come back to Kiev to live again, I would love to live here and just walk everywhere in the city, basically. Like everywhere in the center, of course. Look how nice. I really like this corner. It's a typical, uh, typical Kiev architecture. As I told you, it's called Kiev Modern. I have the street on every every single one of my Ukrainian of my Kyiv vlogs and but never in summer so here you are you're welcome here there are many restaurants and shops and all the stuff and over there in the end of this uh, road there is the funicular and my plan is to take it and go up the hill where we were yesterday and go down from a different side so I will show you something that we still haven't seen I checked in with you, I think it was yesterday, uh, when I was about to meet my friend. 
So I had a coffee, I met my friend, we went to buy a dress for me, the same one that you already saw, the one that was covered in uh, fake tan. They managed to clean it out for me uh, in the shop, so I picked it up all nice and clean and now it's at home and so it will go with me back to Palermo which is very nice, it's very good quality and I really like to support uh, young Ukrainian designers even though this one is kind of like one of the bigger ones today I had my last appointment with my uh, dentist so I have my tooth back and I hope I will not see her again this time around at least uh, after which I bought a basket and after this I decided that I will use it to my advantage so I have some groceries there in order to bake a nice carrot cake for me and my mom and I'm actually walking home today I don't think I will do many things so I think it's going to be quite an uneventful day for you today unfortunately because it's got quite cold and gloomy so I just did some grocery shopping uh, for the cake as I said and for the pancakes and I think that now I will head home and proceed with the cake and tomorrow I will try to take you with me on a small road trip if it's all going to be okay if it's all going to go according to the plan uh, in some villages around Kiev so I think it will be also interesting okay <laughs> crazy people on the street anyways uh, yeah so I'm walking home now and I invite you to walk with me So from the previous clips, uh, we did exactly what we were planning to do. So me and my mom, we went to a small village uh, to see my aunt and uncle and my cousin who were who just moved there. And this village is the place where I spent all of my uh, summers when I was a child. So it was very nice and very nostalgic. And this was the most exciting thing about today. We haven't done pretty much anything else. I just pretty much came back home and went for a walk around my neighborhood. I uh, bought some cosmetic things because I wanted to treat myself to something nice and a facial mask, a facial scrub, all that nice things so now I'm all set for a very nice calm evening and I think this will be the end of the day so I will just relax and enjoy and tomorrow we are going to go and see something nice in the city again I'm going back to being a little bit more active and walking a bit more and showing you a bit and showing you around a bit more up until um, today is Saturday and on Wednesday morning we are going to uh, the western part of Ukraine uh, to Lviv and Ternopil and I'm pretty sure that I will make it a different video and I'm pretty sure you will like it because it's very very different to Kiev but it's very lovely, it's very beautiful and I cannot wait okay so I will check in with you tomorrow and for now this is it for today Hello again, it's the next day and I'm actually uh, wearing the dress that I bought a few days ago and I'm on the territory of my, on the campus of my first university in Kiev, so my alma mater. I'm about to meet my friend here, but first I think I will get a coffee and it's kind of nostalgic to be here, you know, and it, it was not like this when I was studying here, so uh, it's nice to see uh, no cars it's beautiful to see that there are no cars on the territory and then there is a big park and many coffee places and it has wi-fi coverage and everything so it's kind of very cute and nostalgic so now i think we are going to call my friend and see if she wants me to bring her coffee and i will check in with you a bit later Actually, 
my last full day in here in Kiev. Tomorrow we're going, uh, as I told you before, we're going to uh, Western Ukraine to see Lviv and uh, Ternopil. And this is going to be the last evening I spent in Kiev this time. I'm coming back on Saturday quite late. And I'm leaving on Sunday around 3. So I think I will close my Kiev vlog here. Finally, we really have an opportunity to really close the vlog. Um, yeah, it was a great time. It was amazing. It was very nostalgic. And it was also very motivating. And I really enjoyed myself this time here. And I hope to come back in December because this is my home. And I really, this time I really felt like my, this is where I come from. Uh, I might live anywhere. I might really enjoy my living situation at any point in life. But this is where I'm from. So it was a great experience. And I hope I will come back very soon. I hope in December. Uh, if I will have a chance to come back a little bit before, I will be even more happy. So this is where I'm going to close this vlog and from tomorrow I'm going to start a new vlog, which will be Lviv and Ternopil, uh, Western Ukraine, my favorite part of Ukraine. And I know it's going to be awesome. I know it's going to be amazing and you will really enjoy it uh, because you're for sure going along with me. So see you tomorrow in a new vlog and for this one, Thank you very much for being with me. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed my home city as much as I enjoyed it. And see you around. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And I hope to see you in my new videos. Ciao!